How do you tell fresh? Ask the experts. You know it's fresh when it feels just right. Fresh smell, stir up your appetite. Touch it, squeeze it, check it out. See that sign, there is no doubt. Fresh is what we do. Fresh from June to you. Students can gain valuable technical expertise using state-of-the-art broadcast and editing equipment. Classes and workshops run all year round at the Harold Washington Cultural Center. Visit our website at www.haroldwashingtonculturalcenter.com. Students want to learn how to use professional broadcast video equipment? Classes and workshops run all year round at the Harold Washington Cultural Center. Visit our website at www.haroldwashingtonculturalcenter.com. Welcome back. Now let's check the correct answers in the huddle up round. But first, that question once again, the category sports. Name four African Americans featured in headline makers in the sports chapter of American Decades. And the four correct answers are Michael Jordan, Venus Williams, Serena Williams, and Tiger Woods. How did our teams do? Well, the Spartans of Hales had three correct answers for a total of 75 points, which brings their grand total to 85 points. Guitars of the School of the Arts also had three correct answers for a total of 75 points, bringing their total to 285 points. The Tars still leading as we move in into our next round, another head-to-head -head multiple choice round. Are you ready, Spartan? Yeah. Are you ready, Tar? Yeah. yeah. Here we go, here we go. Hip hop culture for 20 points. What person is said to be the most visible of a long tradition of preachers who spoke of singing the word? Keith. C, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. That is correct, C, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. The arts for 20 points. Which one of the following was a 1997 Broadway show, a blockbuster movie, and a ship that sank in 1912? Michael. B, Titanic. That is correct, B, Titanic. Business and the economy for 30 points. By the end of the last decade, what percentage of the companies in America were small businesses? Michael. C, 75%. That is incorrect. Spartans. Well. Keith. B, 50%. That is incorrect. The correct answer is D, 99%. Wow. Media for 30 points. The most popular talk shows of the 90s were hosted by... Adam. B, political, converse... Converse... I don't know that word. It is, that is correct. B, political conservatives. <laughs> Hip-hop culture for 40 points. Which African-American starred in the 1993 film Six Degrees of Separation? Maria. A, Will Smith. That is correct. A, Will Smith. Hip hop culture for 40 points. The groundbreaking rap single, No Sellout, featured whose voice? Ava. A, Muhammad Ali. That is incorrect. Spartan. Keith. B, Curtis Blow. That is incorrect. The correct answer is C, Malcolm X. The arts for 50 points. Along with Wesley Snipes, who starred in the movie New Jack City? Maria. A, Ice T. That is correct. A, Ice T. Business and the economy for 50 points. What percentage of the small businesses launched in the 90s were still in business at the end of the decade? Matthew. B, 50%. That is incorrect. Tars. Ava. C, 60%. That is incorrect. The correct answer is A, 40%. Category media for 60 points. What happened after Jerry Springer agreed to eliminate the foul language and fist fights on his talk show? Keith. B, his ratings fell. Absolutely, B, his ratings fell. Science and technology for 60 points. Last question in this multiple choice head-to-head -head round. Nanotubes, molecules shaped like thin tubes, are 100 times stronger than steel, yet six times what? Maria. A, thicker. That is incorrect, Spartans. Keith. D, lighter. That is correct, D, lighter. What a competitive round, what a competitive round. These young people are on the ball, wouldn't you say, Troy? Yes, they are. And it's now time for the Walgreens Do You Know question of the week. And did you know that when we get back, we'll find out how the students have scored? Stay with us. It's Know Your Head.
Amundsen High School on the north side of Chicago is named after Norwegian Roald Amundsen, who led the first successful Antarctic expedition to the South Pole between what two dates? A, 1908 and 1911. B, 1913 and 1915. C, 1910 and 1912. Or D, 1917 and 1919. I'll have the answer for you right after these messages. She's got your eyes. Can I hold her? Me too. If only you could share moments with everyone almost instantly. Fortunately, Walgreens Digital Service lets you upload photos to Walgreens.com so your friends and family can pick up prints in as little as an hour at thousands of locations. new iced coffee. Premium Arabica blend served on ice for a refreshing drink that wakes you up and cools you down in three delicious flavors, regular, vanilla, and hazelnut. How do you tell fresh? Ask the experts. You know it's fresh when it feels just right. Fresh smell, stir up your appetite. Touch it, squeeze it, check it out. See that sign, there is no doubt. Fresh is the one If you're looking for great food and uncompromising service, look no further than BJ's Market and Bakery on Chicago's South Side. BJ's offers a wide variety of lunch and dinner entrees, including rotisserie smoked chicken, smothered turkey wings, and our house specialty, mustard fried catfish. All are served with your choice of delicious hot or cold sides. You can't resist our homemade desserts, like fresh peach cobbler. The critics agree, BJ's is a soulful delight. BJ's Market and Bakery, food for the soul. Roald Amundsen led the first successfully Antarctic expedition to the South Pole in both 1910 and 1912. Welcome back, welcome back. Let's reveal the scores after that multiple choice round. The Tars of the School of the Arts with 395 points still in the lead. The Spartans from Hales Franciscan, 355 points. But this game is not over yet. Earlier in the show, we asked our young people a, a question, and that question simply was, give us one word that best describes you. We're going to start with Whitney Samuels. One word that best describes you, and that word is? Music. Music, absolutely. Michael Burns, what, what, what word best, de come, come on with it. What word best describes you? <laughs> I picked the word uh, fantab fantabulous. Fantabulous, all right, all right. That is confidence. Ava Roebuck. I believe the team captain and the one word that you chose to describe you was? Original. Original. Yeah. Original. Absolutely. Maria, stolen work. Yes, right. I got that right. One word that you would choose to describe you? Determined. Determined. Absolutely. Sounds good. Sounds good. <laughs> Moving over to the Spartans of Hales Franciscan. Keith. Keith Henley. The one word you chose to describe yourself? Ambitious. Ambitious, absolutely. Adam Bates Moore? I would say influential. Influential, okay. And Leander Alexander, the one word you chose to describe you was? Intellectual. Intellectual. Matthew Winfield? Uh, focused. Focused, all right, absolutely sounds good. Trey, let me ask you. Chats. One word. Chats. That's my final answer. Chess? Chats. It's a way of life. Chats. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Greg, say it with me. Chats. Chet. Chats. Checks? <laughs> Chet. Do what you do, man. Continue hosting <laughs> the show. <laughs> you know, that's interesting because it's very, very difficult to sort of sum yourself up in one word. But that's interesting. Influential, fantabulous, original, 
etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And checks. Well, I'll tell you what. what one, the one word I would, how, well, I would have to say grateful. Okay? Absolutely. Gratitude is my attitude. Please, Keith, join us. And Whitney, joining us for this final face-off round. These two magnificent teams. Now remember, do not open your notebooks until I have completed the question and asked you to do so. The category, sports. The Naismith Trophy is awarded in what collegiate sport? Open your notebooks. Let's start the clock. Possible answers are football, basketball, baseball, or wrestling. All right, close your notebooks. Our time is up. That ends our final round of the day. How did these young people do? Well, we're going to give our judges a moment to tally the scores in the meantime. Trey, take us to a Hey, you can check out all the behind the scenes information and lots of stuff you didn't know by logging onto the website, knowyourheritagegameshow.com. And when we get back, we'll find out who the winners are right here on Know Your Heritage. For behind the scenes footage of Know Your Heritage, check out our website at knowyourheritagegameshow.com. We'll be right back with Know Your Heritage right after these messages. Students can gain valuable technical expertise using state-of-the-art broadcast and editing equipment. Classes and workshops run all year round at the Harold Washington Cultural Center. Visit our website at www.haroldwashingtonculturalcenter.com. McDonald's new iced coffee. Premium Arabica blend served on ice for a refreshing drink that wakes you up and cools you down in three delicious flavors, regular, vanilla, and hazelnut. Hi, I'm Tessa Spencer with this